G'day, today we're going to have a look at the daily challenge uh, in Mini Motorways. So just the details on this one. Now we are the 21st of October. We start with three motorways, we start with four tunnels. So there's no disadvantage to this one. It's just more of an advantage that you've got to just get to start with, um, I guess, stuff that allows you to get through the, the mountains and motorways that allow you sort of to move around a bit easier. Um, the top 10 score in this one is going to be 4,500 at this stage. So let's see how we go. The Zurich definitely isn't one of the easier levels here. So uh, I can imagine that this could be a little bit trickier. That always makes life a little bit trickier if they decide that we should have these guys join together. So let's just disconnect them there. Uh, we could probably just turn that around a little bit wider to make that a nicer curl. I don't know if there's any advantage to it. I, I don't know if they have to sort of like sharply cut in and, and slows them down if they're moving on a weird angle like that. Uh, just for good measure. It looks a little bit prettier and that's enough justification for me. This guy's position's a bit questionable because he's sitting right in between the smallest gap. Uh, so it means that roadways definitely be limited through there but luckily we are starting with four tunnels so we can move through this without too much worry uh so we've already got one bridge so we'll take the roundabout just so we've got one on hand although immediately we're gonna use that bridge so that's our bridges are what we're on the lookout for now, I'm not really in a place to use any of our, use that roundabout yet, I don't think. I mean, possibly these guys could be a candidate for it, just put it in there. Okay. So let's just pause for a second now. We'll put that in there. What we'll do is just use one of our early motorways here and we'll let these guys just share the route. I mean, there's no real need to. We could just have these two guys on their own separate connector to, to jump over there. Um, I mean, ideally we'd probably want this using a bridge other painful sort of connection that we've got there. So I guess one of the two of these gets to have a bridge. Make it the blue guy. What we need to do is just keep this on the, uh, the river. That's actually a really dumb layout. As soon as I've built that, I can immediately see my, my mistake there. What I can easily do is just flip this guy around there and join him uh, and then these guys can go up that way it's a much better layout Okay, so what we'll do is we'll just pause for a second. Get rid of that, get rid of that. We'll have these guys, ah, oh, it's annoying. All right, let's uh, cut this even lower. Have those guys cut down there. We'll have these three guys. Doesn't like that because of the Get rid of that for a second while they figure this out. It'll possibly be just to do with the position of that one at the moment. Just let that disappear and try again. There we go. Now again, we could possibly look at doing this roundabout in there somewhere, but there's not really enough room unless we wasted another tunnel just cutting through here. And also waste a tunnel cutting these guys across this way. Uh, but I'm not sure we necessarily need to at this point. OK, 
Okay, we'll still take the motorway. Never have enough motorways. This yellow guy here could always be a candidate for it too. Um, we'll see. It depends on how it sort of plays out and if there's other guys that become in much more need than the way they currently look. I mean, that's a, an immediate argument to, to give it to them because now I need to have these guys have access south. And they're much closer than this guy is, so them having the just the bridge as opposed to the motorways makes sense. You want to keep an eye on this guy over here as well because he uh, only has the one house that he's operating on. Does mean too what we can do. I don't like I'm joining onto another road. All you have to do is just adjust slightly and you're uh, not on it. Probably the only city council anywhere that gets furious when you attach your house to a road and not just an open field. I've accidentally deleted the, the motorway there, so let's just build that back. Okay, let's Bring these guys underneath. Well, again, these guys are going to have to have a motorway. Whether we can get a motorway all the way over there seems unlikely. Instead, what we'll do is we'll have them cut through the mountains. Nice little theme of a crisscross right in the middle here. traffic lights just because I don't have any. Um, what I'm going to do is adjust this to just what we can do is see if we can fit a roundabout in here somewhere. Move that out of the way. The pointless thing about this is that I wanted the, the roundabout in here to make this connection a little bit Less in the way of, of this guy here, but if anything, that's possibly we've just made it more in the way. But now he can get around there without having to cut through the mountain. I just, even though I've still got three tunnels, I'm still very aware of them because I feel like that they uh, they could catch up to me and be a problem later on. Okay, so this guy here, we can use our bridge and run him up the waterway. And we'll get this guy to help out. Not sure about this design of this this here, but keep it for now. Weird little mess of a connection for these guys. Probably not enough going on here to warrant giving them a roundabout. Okay, so I don't have a bridge to take care of this guy. So, time being, we'll give them a highway to their doorstep. But that's a, a future plan for a bridge. If we get a broad bridge this week. Cool. So, cool. I was going to say, so our problem was that we're getting more houses, but we're not getting anything uh, down the bottom here. Let's sort of that out. Um, because those are the back two houses to this guy, now uh, they're not even going to work with him. I don't have to finish that thought. Because they were the back two houses, I was connecting them to the back, not to the front, because I'd slow down everyone if they were part of this intersection. So, we do have 45 connection still, but we, what we don't have is um, bridge, 
So again, these guys can just have a motorway as close to it as they can get. Actually, let's um reverse this. So I'm going to get rid of that, and I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to turn these guys around. We're going to get rid of that very carefully so we don't have to leave that highway. And these two guys cut straight through the mountain get to him once that highway goes away and these two guys once that highway disappears can just jump from there to here that's a bit it's it makes uh, I was gonna say it makes this guy's trip a little bit longer but it doesn't because they now benefit from a highway so they're probably moving as fast to get to him as these two are to get to that. But that idea of having to go up and then swing down was very long for this guy, so this seems like a much better outcome for him. Hopefully this guy won't complain either. Roundabouts I don't see any use for um, with this escalating. So I um, won't use him. Having this house right here means that we can potentially get rid of this future development. I don't think we need to connect him to anything at the moment. This guy here, I'm not sure we need to connect to anything either. It's interesting that this obviously must be working so effectively that um, these guys have the priority of, of taking care of him, not these two that, are that seem like they're closer. seems to be going okay at the moment. I mean, we're only 500 in. So generally, if you're not going okay at this point, you're you're really in trouble. Okay, the second green community isn't really going to help where it's positioned. I mean, the only thing that potentially it could, could do is if it's, um, there's a straight line that it can happily take care of all the way to there can so let's get rid of that one that whole setup and because he is further away I'm gonna send him around the back so that he doesn't slow down everyone he just sort of slows down the guys um, the sort of like it's the last house in line okay so now we have no bridges and we have no um, highways and we have this guy here, so the initial build is going to be that these guys are going to have to latch onto him. Just do that, that little setup. Just put a set of traffic lights in there while this is our, our setup. have this guy connect in somewhere too. We'll take the, the tunnel. And it just means that for another week at least uh, this setup is going to stay in place. Unless this is white, um, I think this is going to be a really tricky one to deal with. But we'll probably want to use our roundabout somewhere down here. He's a real problem child at the moment because not only is he circular and so far away from his houses, um, but there's also only one green, which means that if green starts to stack as just orders coming in, uh, we could struggle with him. So. He Sometimes I've found that, say, because we've got so many blue warehouses, that blue shouldn't ever really be 
well hopefully shouldn't be the struggle point because they um will just continue to um like they'll sort of divide their workload between them whereas green on his own yeah it could be a problem could be a troublemaker okay so let's bring him in there and we'll swing this guy around to help out with uh, this guy so he's got four and this guy's got five another tunnel we probably don't need at this point like traffic lights guys here aren't of much use at this point just a little community again we're getting a lot of yellow houses for just two um, warehouses okay so that's a real real pain that one because what we don't have is available blue houses to go anywhere um, we did just get that third house here so possibly this is our fix Let me just move that that highway down to over there. Now blues and yellows coming in opposite sides of that warehouse. It's not necessarily great, but I think I think generally you're better off having them come in on the same side. Because you can see that when they do come into the um into the parking lot they'll go up the the right hand side and then turn left into a spot and so when they're doing coming in opposite directions they are working against each other okay so let's pause for a second there what we can do is we can get rid of that get rid of that have these guys swing up here get rid of that so that now those guys don't have to go through red to get to to their guy now he's not looking too too great at the moment though uh, we do want to get someone else to help him out so what we'll do a little population get down here is we're going to disconnect these three from there for now and we are just going to do a quick little makeshift fix oh, i hate doing that I can't tell you how much I hate doing that. So what have we just connected? We've actually connected these guys to here. Uh, we've disconnected yellow. Like that. So we want to just try dragging this again. No, nope, missed it again. Oh, now I've deleted it entirely. There we go. Now this yellow isn't doing too great either. Um, Again, it would be good to get these three yellow guys over there to assist, uh, but this highway is, is currently occupied. So you can see that all six of these guys aren't home at the moment. And that's what we want to just quickly keep an eye on. We're going to remove this now because we do need to give it to these guys. Hopefully what they've just come in and done is enough to have this these two manage that again for a while. Uh, and two different ways that we can do this. So one will be that we just take Highway 3 and then we swing it over to these three guys that aren't being used for anything. And we get them to just do a quick surge of six extra cars that can come in, cause a little bit of traffic jam down there, uh, and then sort it out. Okay, now that's an okay ad. Um, it's bad because it runs right into these guys, but it's good because the guys that he's going to use are right behind him. So what we can do is just move him up a bit. We can make that adjustment. Swing those guys down there, and then we'll wait for that highway to connect. And we don't necessarily want them connecting on the point of here, so we'll just put a set of lights there. We'll wait for them to. We'll wait for this highway to go away. A 
Well, there's a few more houses to help this guy out. He shouldn't be a problem. Fourth house over there. Uh, and then we can join these. Okay. So, the next thing is that we've got five houses up here and we've got four houses down there. So what we could do is we don't need both of these connections existing. We've now gained another motorway as well, so we don't need to keep using this Highway 3 as our emergency motorway. Oh cool, there's five houses there. Okay, so now we've got five there. Uh, what we will do is... See this guy here, he's a, I knew he was a big pest. There's nothing wrong with his setup. Uh, it's just pure distance, and uh, but he's still gonna struggle everyone away from home, so... I don't like that. Do I have a bridge? So I can't bring him around the back. Um, Alright, let's get rid of that road there. We can then turn these five guys around. All going to the same one point. Now they can't get over to him as directly. But I mean, that's pretty close. So what we'll do is we'll just use them as, as a surge assistance. Uh, you can see that, what, six of the guys, seven of the guys, eight of the guys, nine of the guys from there have all gone. Now, those guys are also going because they're now considered closer. So they're the, um, they're, I mean, at first, this is the way you always look at this, that they're going to make it a little bit worse before they make it better. You can see how much they've just sort of, like, come in the wall and, um, okay, so a few things to look at. This guy here, okay, we've got white guys struggling all over the place. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of this highway and we're going to turn these guys around, send them down here. Let's do it like that so that the closest guy is, is the most direct. Okay, and uh, let's put a set of lights on that. Now, the white guys that are having problems. So we have a whole community of guys here. Ugh. I can't even replace it because it's a pain. All right, so roundabout. And what we will do is we will disconnect all that from there. And these guys all then change to being in support of this guy who's also struggling. We do want to get these guys on too. We'll make them the weird connection, but give them a set of lights. Now these guys can do a quick surge of assistance too. Hopefully so can these guys to, to try and get up there. Because you can see he's looking even worse. I'm still worrying about that guy, but not much we can do. Okay, now this guy here is, is struggling again. Uh, we do have a motorway that we can use for him. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to give that guy... I'm going to give them to him. Get rid of all of that. Uh... Sorry, I don't have a spare motorway. I realize what I have is I've just got that one back after I accidentally removed it. Might as well just step that out one extra spot. What did I need that extra? I can't remember what I was about to use that for. Right, this, this guy's here. Okay. So what we'll do instead is we'll make these guys cut through here. And do that. So what this will allow is, is our whites and, and blues to not have to work through each other. And then that means that we do have this spare. We can give to these three guys. Now it does give them one extra. Let's do this the other way again because again I'm struggling with dragging that around up there. Give these guys the quick three. Um, He's definitely now going to be a problem of his own. 
So, how far back can I work? So I can't go any further than, than where we already are. I do have another... That's right, did I delete two of those? So I actually do have a spare. I do actually have a spare. Okay, so... Alright. What we'll do is... These three guys here... Uh, we will turn around... Get out of the way. Flunkiest looking little road. Get him to connect that way. Go through here. Let's put a set of lights there. We'll see how they go with that setup for now. Cool, that fourth house will help. have is um, do have that spare motorway so what we'll do is we'll actually just disconnect these guys from that sent let them take the, the motorway down now this is a long trip for these guys here but again it's there's not really too much we can do with it um, even if we had a, a motorway with it the motorway is only going to take them from about there to there just sort of get connected there to help out I suppose. Goodness, how many how many white uh, warehouses do we need? So this guy's not looking too crash hot. I mean, he just luckily at least got two houses that are closer to him than anything else he had prior. So what we'll do is bring these two guys into this setup too. Put that there. See where we can work to with this. We can get to that one white house here. He can join to these guys, but obviously they're needed for, for what they're currently doing. Otherwise I can get him down to about there. Which isn't really much use either. So the alternative would be um, that we sort of Have him um, just move him out of the way. Make a join there, and then have just my way seven connect to that, and then have these guys work on both. But I mean, even at that point, it almost seems more worthwhile to just have him join to both. See how that works for now. My guess is going to be badly. You can already see that both these guys aren't looking too crash hot. Uh, and there's no one home. So what we'll do is we will turn around these two guys because um, all three of these guys had both people at home. So there's more work required on this side than there is looking after this guy. Uh, this dude is not doing well. But what we can do is move him out of the way. This guy connect in. We'll have this guy hop over that. Like this is only like a very seldom used house at the back there, so we should be able to come in to help. Um, Red's doing bad all over the place. Uh, we'll take just the traffic lights we're using a little bit more. This guy will claim to this side too because he's at home. Uh, we'll let that guy come in and help there too. Actually another yellow house here as well. So I 
think that what we need to do is just address um, problems that we currently have with our extra motorway. So we get these two guys. I don't know. I guess if we go up, they can connect to there. We can put a traffic light there. It's, again, it's not a very pretty road. What it means is that we can claim this motorway and put it there. Just want to build the road onto it. Ugh. Oh, but it doesn't like it because of where I've placed it, so it's just around the corner there. So again, these guys can just do a quick little surge assist. Now this guy here is, isn't happy. He's got five houses on him. Um, this guy here, we can't get across to him. There's a huge population of red over here that we really should be using for this. Uh, they are using a motorway here. But there's no real way to get these guys all together without either having them have to work across blue or across white. This guy here get the help out with that one at least. It does seem at least that I should be doing more like that. But we should make this more. that's a terrible move because now what we've got to do is wait for that, that road to move before anyone um, before anyone keeps coming so we actually should just leave it as is annoyingly. means that we need to address this another way. You can see all the guys from here apparently in use too. So we can't just pull houses quickly from that. Green up here is struggling as well. Now how's our yellow makeshift help? The green's just springing up all over the place down here. Okay, so we're going to declare that this guy's pretty fine. Oh, we do have an extra motorway already. Did I delete that from somewhere? Not sure. Okay. So. This guy is still just a normal square, so that's the only reason that we're going to disrespect him by cutting across him. Cutting these five guys... We'll get to there. This guy we can move, we can put a connection there, and then we can put highway just across there. We'll put a set of lights. Oh, we can't put a set of lights on that intersection. Okay. So the other thing that we need to try and work out is how can we get more green guys onto this? Annoyingly, we could have done it immediately by just having actually okay, what we can do is we can take These guys, run them straight up there. Let's see if we can, you can see how many houses, how car, many cars, sorry, are immediately coming. Try and help out, so hopefully they get in there just in time to surge this guy back in the right direction. Okay, now red here is looking quite the mess, so is red down here. Um, now this is as far south as we go down this way, so we can't bring these guys down and across to, to this. Um, this guy is planted in such a position, you feel like he could be beneficial to everyone, but he's beneficial to no one. And these guys are sort of sort of okay. It's just that this, this is just a traffic jam that they're creating that somehow making it okay. So I can't believe that through all this, this one dude here with his two houses has just been fine. Like no complaints. Just happy to keep going. Happy to be here. Um This is the dinkiest little highway. Yeah, red is the huge question mark here. 
get this guy attached to the right, right one. I mean, this, this road here isn't, like, failing because of lack of support. You can see that there's so many cars waiting to get in <laughs> that that's his problem. Um... But it's whether it's him or this guy that's going to fall. Uh, keep I'm an iron about how to get this guy involved. But this is just a complete wall here. I suppose what we could do is cut him. A, I don't have any tunnels, so you can't cut across. I suppose what we can do is because we've got all of this support here, I mean, it's only five houses at this point because these back two guys aren't connected, neither are all these guys. This guy here's struggling as well. There are any tunnels that I've got that just don't, aren't really needed? I'm not sure that is the case. These two guys here possibly. Let's just pull that out of there for now. Wait for this, this one guy to come back. But this guy here, I can't. Although now suddenly he's now our front runner being a problem. But we can get him. Involved to help that out slightly. Good to get this guy involved too, but I'm sure that's the case. I mean, this guy's problem is purely just that all of Red has a problem, and they're just sort of stacking on each other to to address it. Uh, right, so this guy here we can now cut through there. We'll put a set of traffic lights in there for him. You can even see that with just that one switch, this guy here is now in panic mode too. Pretty much everyone's in panic. This guy here is still looking worse. Lose everywhere. This guy here finally, my uh, my one I complimented. I think he's going to be the one that, that gets me in the end. There we go. Alright, not too bad. Uh, I guess let's have a look how we did on the standings. 56. I guess can't be too unhappy with that. There we go. Any questions or comments, feel free to chuck them below. But until next time, catch you later. See ya.